When two parallel lines are intersected by a third line, we call this line a transversal. And sometimes we use the phrase that the parallel lines are cut by a transversal. And this transversal causes two separate intersections that have a lot of relationships. So first, let's take a look at the corresponding angles. Here we can see, no matter how we angle this transversal, wherever we move this parallel line, that the corresponding angles are congruent. And this concept we just more or less understand to be true. And, you know, this makes sense because parallel lines have a common slope. They kind of increase in the same manner. So when you take a third line and intersect it, the intersections themselves should be very similar, and the angles formed should be similar, and in fact, congruent. So the fact that corresponding angles are congruent is called the corresponding angles postulate. You can also notice with the diagram that every angle here has a vertical angle, which is also congruent, and every angle also has a linear pair, which is supplementary. So if we take a look at all of these angles, we see that we have some other relationships. So the first of these relationships is regarding alternate interior angles. And as you can see through the linear pair postulate and the vertical angles congruence theorem, that alternate interior angles are also congruent. How about alternate exterior angles? Well, again, through things like the linear pair postulate and the vertical angles congruence theorem, we can prove that they're also congruent. Now, how about same side interior angles or consecutive interior angles? These guys aren't congruent, but again, through things like the linear pair postulate and the vertical angles congruence theorem, we can see that these guys are, in fact, supplementary. So these three relationships, outside of the corresponding angles postulates, are all theorems which can be proven. And they're called the alternate interior angles theorem, the alternate exterior angles theorem, and the consecutive, or same side, interior angles theorem.